This is Mrs. Hair going back out to Bay Boy Never. Bay Boy never heard of WhatsApp, they only heard my brother Bernie's WhatsApp there to you, alright? We were looking for drugs on thick and this and that the other. Right. And you start getting vexed and this and you start looking for void. Well, I tell you one thing, Bay Boy. You're a blind man, as the whole country knows that. You're blind in one of your eyes yourself, maybe down, God bless tomorrow. But, Bay Boy, you're looking for void. Do you remember one time ago, Bay Boy, you were in Lock House Jail? Your brother Patrick. Your brother Mikey, the nigger they call him, your brother John Joe, was in a country man's house called Lee Dolly. And I was in the same house the same night drinking with him. Patrick started chatting about this and that and the other. I don't want to get into the detail of it, yeah? But if I had to get into the detail with a reply back to you, I will get back into detail. And I will open the book and I will open the covers. What he was saying about my father. And I will open it. And I will open it fairly fast and fairly handy. Right? So, number one, I want to say to you, your brother Patrick started threatening me, he cooked me this way and that way, you're in Longford all on your own. You probably heard now WhatsApp there the day ago, do you remember that? I was in Longford on my own, alright? Right? He tried to cook me with a pint glass. I picked up an aspirin, I grabbed him by the neck, and I twisted, I twisted the bastard. Do you know the t shirt that you had him? I twisted and I choked him. And I st- Dead back him and forced all my weight on him and I hold him five or six wraps with the asteroid and nearly blinded the bastard. God forgive me, it was a pity that I didn't blind the bastard. Right. You're looking for a fight. Your brother Patrick will never get a rematch with me. Right? Me and your brother Patrick fought. I was fucked up on drink. I'm not much 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 more better today. Right? But I'm able to pay for my drink, and anything I want, I'm able to pay for that. And if I run short on anything, I can go to my mother, I can go to my brothers, and they will be able to help me out with anything I want. Right? Anything I want, my family will be able to help me out with that, if I need it. But I don't need that. I don't need to depend on my family. I can I can do this, I can get all this, what I want, whenever I want, and how I want. Anything I want, I can have it myself. Right? There's no one on about money or anything, right? So, why did your brother Patrick look for fair play of me after I couldn't? But sure, that shows how much of a pussy is. If, he, if Patrick wants fight, Patrick get the eye to fight. He will get plenty of fight. Patrick 100% get plenty of fight, bad boy. Right? You, you, you dirty, you dirty bowsy. You. And the cheeky, the cheeky your cousins to go around called junkies. So it shows you now who the junkies is. Doesn't it show you now who there's a god above? Fella called me a junkie the other day on a WhatsApp. It fell back in your sides, didn't it? Ringing up my brothers. Your cousins calling junkies. But yet their cousins, which is you, ringing up my brother looking for drugs. I'll tell you one thing now, baby boy. If your brother Patrick wants fight, he'll get fight. I have Patrick under my belt. And I'm going to have another two or three under my belt before Christmas. But I want one more man. And I swear my father's been my life. Before it hits Christmas, I'm going to have one more man under my belt. So cheery on me, Cheerio now, bear boy. I'm uploading this now, so good luck and goodbye from around me, you sheepdog, yeah. You old bowsy.